What's the difference between analogous structures and homologous structures? Well, first of all, analogous structures are structures that evolved independently in two separate lineages since the last speciation event. And they also happen to solve the same problem that we find in nature and were crafted by similar natural selectional forces. So one of the main examples of analogous structures include things like the wings of birds versus the wings of insects. Now, of course, they solve the same problem of flight, but the wings of birds use forearms while insects use these separate appendages. So they don't have the same type of structural similarity that you would expect from a common ancestry. Now, on the other hand, homologous structures are structures that were passed down to descendant species from a single common ancestor. So in the case of forearms of tetrapods, we always have the humerus, the radius, the ulna, the carpals, metacarpals, and phalanges. And this is consistent, whether you're talking about a cat, a chimpanzee, a bat, or a whale, or of course, humans. And while some of these structures may serve different functions now, you see that structural congruence because of that common ancestry. Now, one thing to keep in mind is that analogous structures form from what we call convergent evolution. But be careful because this convergence doesn't mean that the species are actually converging into a single species. Clearly, birds and insects are not the same species. So the idea of convergence is just really figurative speech. 